Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to Let's Play Oblivion, where Aran is off down to Wayneham Priory to try and help a couple of guys with their farm of some crap, basically. Not crap as much as it is creatures. And I'm guessing these are the two guys in question. Hello, sir, and sir. Antics, calm down. We'll be leaving soon enough. I just can't wait. This is going to be the greatest fight ever. Oh, really? This is no joke, Antis, and it's nothing to be excited about. If you don't want to be doing this, then why are you even here? Father and I can handle this. I'm um, here because even though I'm, I'm probably going to die, I know that we have to do this. Father would feel the same way. Father's not scared. Don't you dare say that. You'll see when he gets here. I'll ask him, and then you'll see. Will we? Will we really? Will we see? Um, okay. Hello, sir. I'm afraid I have no time for small talk, friend. I'm waiting for my father, Valis Odil. Have yes, you seen I've him met in town him. By any chance? I have. Um, he's not coming. He's not coming with us? I think I understand, and it is better that he remains safe. So I wonder why he has asked you to take his place. You would join us, though you have no personal stake in this fight? Hm, an honorable deed. I gladly accept your help, then. There's no point in waiting here any longer. Follow me. Well, well my stake was going to be cash. Excuse we me. can't keep stopping to talk like this. We've got to get out there and fight. Okay, 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 dude. Um, we will yeah, I, I want to discuss the fact that my stake was... Way. My stake was money? Uh, what creatures are we talking about as well, just before I die horribly? I think I'm ready for this, but I worry about Antus. He's never <laughs> seen a fight like this before. Okay. The farm is near. Stay you're, you're, you're creating a lot of anticipation that I'm not appreciating. Um... On the bright side, it is getting dark, so um, hopefully my base powers will be sort of returning. Greetings to you. Um, which will help make me stronger, because my strength drops during the day. I believe um, my strength is currently sixty-three. I don't know if it'll go up. It's after seven p.m., but um, my base strength does grow at night, you see. Hang on, let me grab one of these health potions, you see. Very useful for health potions. Not so much that, but, um, you know, I'll take what I can get. Uh, this side of the wall or that side of the wall? So you say it's down here. I'm guessing this is the farm in question, guys. I mean, not hugely appreciating the rain. It could be slightly less horrific rain. Yes, I found a farm. I'm assuming you guys are going to come down behind me. I'm not sure why your brother's running around so excitedly. Because um, I am mildly concerned. Flax, always useful. Um, the farm is locked. Excuse me a second. Oh, I don't have the magic and I'm going to get spotted, so... Um, maybe I should armor up before I get into this fight. It's probably going to be a good idea. Boom and shield, greaves, and... Oh, orcish greaves. Boots. Orcish greaves. Um... What boots am I wearing? Uh, Dolphin boots, okay. So yes, yes, we are all kitted up. Helmet, 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 helmet. Gotta protect the noggin. Okay. What terrible creature is here? Tomatoes? Tomatoes did have a use. I did have a use for them. I don't know what it was now. 
and I used my carrots too, so the fact there are carrots here, oh those are radishes, actually radishes were good for something as well, I think radishes were I using them for chameleon with blood grass, so I'll take your radishes too, don't mind me, I'll just, I'm just trying to lure the creatures in by pretending to farm guys, pretending to pick the plants and you know, lure the creatures in. We have arrived at Odo Farm. I need to help Antus and Rallus Odo defeat the creatures that have been plaguing their home. Okay. Stay okay. Stay focused. Watch your backs and be careful. Antus, um, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. I'm less ready. Here they come. Here they come. What are we talking about here? Uh, we're talking about goblins. Okay, we're talking about goblins. And I am going to straight away restore some of my Magica. And I'm going to get my skeletal minion at the ready. I'm worried about hitting these guys. Let's, um, oh, they, he died really easy. Get out of the way, guys. He was easy to kill. That was that was simple enough. No problem. Lock picks. Um, silver war axe. Nice. Okay, we'll get our skeletal distraction up as well. Oh, I killed my own skeletal distraction. Die, goblin skirmisher. Take your sword. Look at all this. Look the loots. There we go. I'll take that as well. Anything else? Any more for any more? Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to pick the plant there. Uh, rusty iron short sword. I'll take the lock picks. I'm not really worried about the rusty iron short, short sword. Oh, no! Uh oh. I think I might have killed one of the brothers. I killed one of the brothers. I'm sorry, guys. Oh no, both the brothers are dead. Uh oh. Maybe I'm not going to be popular at the town for this. Where's my skeletal minion? He's supposed to be helping me. Your armor skill is increasing. No, no work. Okay, the goblins have been defeated. I should inform Valis Odil that his sons did not survive. Yeah, I think I actually accidentally killed one of them. Silver short sword. What we got here? Dormer war axe. Um, yeah. Iron long sword, not particularly worth it. I'll take the key. Um, steel short sword. Again, we're not talking major pickings here, particularly. Um, rusty dagger. What was that on the floor that I can't seem to grasp? You used to be able to grab the bodies and move them. Uh, that's just a dagger that's attached to his hand. Um, yeah, I'm sorry, dude. Uh, it it could have gone better. I was all there prepared to do a good deed. Take the lock picks. But, um, it seems like my good deed went awry slightly. Um, eh. Uh, I kind of feel bad that both his sons died. Well, yeah. Well, you might as well loot the place. They're probably not going to need their stuff. Why am I seen? Oh, guy's coming up the hill. 
guys coming up the hill to see the goblins killed them. Officer. Officer, the goblins killed them. Would have been nice if they'd come up earlier because they might have got off their horses and joined in the fight. And uh, that might have saved one of the, one of the one of the brothers, but um, hmm, I would like to just um, pillage their house a little first. But I seem to be highly visible. I'm gonna get changed quickly back out of my uh, armor. to improve my sneak a little. I'll grab that and we'll put the sword away. Clearly they can still see me. But um, sorry, I'm sneaking because of the goblins. I didn't want to get caught by them. Honestly, it was a terrible thing. Damn goblins. Every time, it's always the goblins. Seriously, what can still see me? What can still see me here? There's nothing here. I'm still visible, I'm still visible. What am I visible to? Yeah, I'm, I'm still visible here as well. I'm going to risk it. For a biscuit, he says, as I have the key. I wonder if I'll get a bounty on my head. Let's have a quick check. I got a bounty. My infamy is seven. What's my current bounty? I can't see. Bounty is zero. Okay. So despite that, no one actually saw me. So that's at least one good thing. But, oh, small backpack. Worth having. Just for sale, selling purposes. Anything else? A wooden spoon. Excellent. Um, shovels, jugs, blah, blah, blah. A bed. Ooh, an urn root. What do pears do? Nothing useful. No. It's not looking promising. I was hoping for more. Well, I mean, at least they, the goblins had decent weapons. I guess I can extract my payment from that. Because I can't ima imagine the um, father wanting to pay me very much after I've uh, ended up with both his sons dead. Um, yeah. Yeah, never know, maybe you will give me a shock spell. Because I'm still desperate for a shock spell after last time. Hello, sir. Welcome to Coral. Thank you. Keep your nose clean, and we'll be good friends. Make a mistake, and the Coral Guard will be all over you like a cheap curus. Okay. Fair enough. Oh. What seems what? to be the... What can you tell me about the creatures? I... We've heard the old man's story. Nothing to back it up, though, except the word of those two kids of his. <laughs> no real evidence. Yeah. Even if it was true, it's out in the forest somewhere. We need to keep what's inside the town walls safe, not go running around outside them. Well, really, you should know it resulted in their death. Take care. And uh, hopefully... You will you be hail? sorry for that. And where do I hail? Just down the road is from where I hail. Right, let's get back up here to Carl and see what 
the old man has to say. Well, I guess with any luck we can go in and uh, rob the bookshop. That would probably work for us. All right, let's get that open. Tidings, citizen. Tidings, indeed. Unfortunately, this is going to be sad tidings. Uh, he is not going to be a happy bunny. Where is he? Are you out over here? No, you're, you're, you're the drunken fellow. Where is he? Where'd he go? Oh, you're about the ugliest barmaid I've ever seen. And that's <laughs> saying quite a bit. Come to bring me another round, have you? Uh, not My really, mistake. no. Shouldn't you be on the other side of Cyrodiil by now? Um, not really, no. No, I shouldn't. Where is that guy then? Where did he go? Um, surely, says the goblins have been defeated, I should return to Al-Zabalibar Al and um, tell him that his sons did not survive. But, um, I can't find the guy, which is a tad on the unfortunate side. Um, Good evening, sir. Good evening. Where, where is everyone? I mean, she's asleep. Where's the other guy? Evening. Evening. You're you're here because he's stolen your bed. Even though you've Even, paid sir. for the room. The other guy? I don't know where he's gone. Oops. Slight control issues there. Where, where is the other guy? I mean, I suspect my quest marker is out to... Is out to cloud top, yeah. So I don't know where this other guy is. I'm loath to use the quest marker. Because it always seems like a bit of a crap thing to me. Maybe he's living behind the pub as a beggar or something like that. Because he seems he did seem to come out this way once before. I don't know where he is. That is a shame. But nevertheless I have other things to do. Is everything all right? Everything is absolutely fine. So yes, with my other things to do, if I can't find this guy, which it seems he is not apparently around here anywhere. I mean, we could always check. He doesn't have a house here as well, do they? No, apparently not. Oh no, yes, he does. Um. I'm going to break and enter. I'll say I did it with the key. No, he, he's not here. Well, nothing like extracting a bit more uh, thing there. Oh no, he is here. That's a shame. Shouldn't have robbed him. Um, but I'm going to do it again. No, not worth robbing. Um, yes, sir. We'll talk to him. Uh, I'm sorry, Robinson I'm, I'm in here. Need your help, whether they know it or not. There's no time to waste. Yeah, I, I've kind of come in here without your permission, but it, it's to bring you bad tidings, sir, about Foul these creatures. Things. Yes, they deserve the death you brought them. Yeah, well, they while well, they deserve the death they brought them, there were two who didn't deserve the death that we brought them they they didn't make it oh god they died out there all alone yeah. i should have been with them it should have been me not them i i'm sorry you did all you could i'm sure i did thank you for trying i did all i could I'm afraid i have nothing i might have stabbed you. one of them 
What little money I have must now be spent on burials. Please, if you'll excuse me. Get yeah. out of here. Yeah, I didn't expect to get anything from them. Yeah, he's not a cheerful fellow. Um, well, it's not exactly a surprise that he's not too happy about it. I'm, I'm a bit miffed I didn't get anything. You know, I did put my life on the line as well. But, um, yeah, at the same time, it's not completely ununderstandable that he wouldn't want to give me anything. And I did get money through other means during it. But now, now, we have the much more important task to do of robbing Renoir's books. We'll just wait to get the Magica up and we should be good to go. Boink. In we go. God, I love having that spell. I think I've checked most of this stuff before. What I need to try and do is to try and liberate the key. This may not be so easy. Uh, pickpocket. Let's, let's take it. Oh god, I think I was spotted. Was I spotted? I have got a bounty, yes. But I'm going to try again. Because she didn't... She seemed to spot me, but not spot me. Oh, she's already caught me. I know she already caught me. Not the point. I... Yeah, she's already caught me, apparently, and I can't come back and do it again. Damn it. The telepathic guards will be after me. I mean, there is another option, but I'm not sure she's actually killable. The blood's good. Let's see if that reset it. No, I, I, I'm naffed. Damn. I have to come back and have a go Stop! another time. Oh, you violated God. the law. Pay the court a fine or serve your sentence. Your stolen goods are now forfeit. Uh, the telepathic guard is after me. Then pay with your... Oh, God, here we go. Time to leave. Because telepathic guards and everything is going to be like, Stop! Criminal scum. So we'll just try and sneak past this guard, who's probably then going to spot me. And I may as well steal a beaten horse while I'm at it. And then we can bomb our way back down to the Imperial City. How am I visible? I am not visible, people. Uh, I get further bounty on my head because the horse can see me somehow. And it's going to report me for stealing it. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, no, 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 no. For a second there. For a second there, I was invisible. Where's this guy going? Go away. Come on. How am I visible? Who can see me? Screw it. We're taking the horse. Um... This isn't the right way, is it? I need to go that way. Which means I'm going to have to go through past another guard who's probably telepathically going to come after me as well. I don't know what it is with the guards in Cyrodiil, but they have some sort of 
second sight vision going on. They seem to know when you're wanted by the law. But with that, we will leg it. Hopefully, maybe we can check out the um, that thieves den in um, in the Imperial City when we get there. I mean, I can I can deposit three of those welcome stones as well. I just don't want to deposit all four because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need one for the cloud top job, which I which I really want to do. This is a hold-up. Eh? Hand it over or die. Oh, uh, I was there wondering what the hell you were, and then I discovered you were a highwayman. Well, Mr. Highwayman, you can't run that Easily. fast. So, I'll see you later. Job done. So, yeah, um, I will probably hold fire here unless something else exciting happens on the way back and um, you can join me again when I reach the Imperial City and welcome back ladies and gentlemen where we seem to be developing a collection of stolen horses at the Imperial City um, hopefully you'll head back to Chaden Hall um, and we'll be all good because, uh, yeah, I don't particularly want to have the same situation I've got in Breville where I seem to have run out of horses to steal. It means I'm going to have to buy one, which is really not what I want to do. So, what's the time? The time is 5am, which is rather limiting in itself. What has happened to the ground here? Um, with that, I am going to save... I don't know what's happened to the ground here. Hopefully that's just a weird night evening lighting bug that seems to be going on there. Um, that's weird. Maybe it's, maybe it's the water on the cobbles. But something weird seems to have happened. Um, yes, and we will go into the city. Where everything Are you not appears to be okay. Ah, yes. It's Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are back after a sort of crash there from Oblivion. And um, I'm a bit more hopeful this time that we're going to be fine as we go through the doorway. As the road seems to have fixed itself before we got there. So I'm a little bit more hopeful that we're going to make it in one piece without any more oblivion excitement as we pass through. However, the thought I had just left off as I was walking up here and oblivion decided to crash uh, was that we still have to get into that guy's house in the temple working? district. I don't remember which way it is. I'm what sure is it, it's... Citizen? And that's the Imperial Elven Garden, so I think it's that way. Um, there's a guy's house we were supposed to get in in the Temple District. Now, he's not... He's supposed to be a vampire, so he'll likely be in, but we can catch him. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm over-encumbered. It must be 6 a.m. Um, hang on. Eh, eh, come out of that. Thank you. Uh, there we go. Yes. There was this gentleman's house. Um, which was just down here somewhere, I believe. Someone's house we needed to get into. Now, the other thing I need to do is obviously sell off some of the crap I've got with me. 
Um, but the shops aren't open yet. And I might be able to get into this guy's house. Or not, as the case may be. Uh, oh, I don't have enough Najika. Right. So we might be able to get straight in here. This time, he says. Just knocking this off the list. Plus, it would be a good place to sort of lay low. I mean, depending on if he's a vampire, maybe we can come to some sort of agreement on what we do. I mean, obviously he's being hunted by vampire hunters, but if they're hunting him, it's probably only a matter of time before they catch on to me. They seem to invite me to do it. I have arrived at Ro uh, Roland Jensrick's house. I should begin to search for clues. Any clues about his whereabouts? Because, you know, they had said he hadn't seen him. I can't get in the hard lock. Um, boar meat. Which is useful for potions. I might be able to make some health potions. Avar song, Singstone. Songstone? Songstone, isn't it? Singerstone. A handbill. Let's check upstairs. Oh, I'm out of magic. This is going to be a recurring theme, isn't it? Well, at least I'm getting through those cheap, cheap, rubbishy Ajika potions. I think it's because I was out in effectively daylight again. Alright. But at least it's given me plenty of practice with my newfound power. Very hard chest. There's some things in here worth remembering it's here. Loose suede shoes. Better not step on those. A hard lockbox. Hmm. Very little sign of anything here. I mean, I'm not going to be able to get into a lot of those locks. Damage agility. Not really something that's particularly useful. Hello. There's a. Is that a recipe? Is it? Oh no! I I've dropped it. Oh. Don't you just hate it when you drop a note or a recipe down behind a desk? To create a restore, f oh, restore fatigue, come on, man. Very hard. Is there a key around here somewhere? The kind of guy who leaves a key lying around? Um, He's got a calcinator. He has got a skull on his desk. There is always that, and he has skulls on the shelf. This to me does tend to indicate that he is not the most stable of people. I mean, I would be concerned about that, typically. Hmm. So I haven't managed to find any um, sign of anything. Oh, look, he's got a bar in his basement. Sweet. This guy's got quite the pad. Potion, strong potion of sea stride. Strong potion of something else. Might, I think that was. Wow, nice vintage wines as well. I'll take them. The man's got quite a lot of good stuff here. I mean... I can't find much evidence of of anything really. Oh, a couple of things of skooma as well. The shopping list. Side of beef, onions, corn, mead, three loaves of bread. Ah, aside from enjoying his bread by the looks of it, there's nothing incriminating there. No. I don't see much in the way of incriminating evidence. I will have to take another Magica potion, I'm afraid. 
Um, what are we going to do? That one will do. I don't really want to take them too much, but I am going to have to... Oh, letter. From... Love letter from Relfina. She's the girl who died, yes? After searching Roland's home, I found a letter written to Roland from his girlfriend. It mentions a cavern where the two would meet. Its location east of Imperial City in the Great Forest. I think this may be where Roland could be hiding. I should head there immediately before he has a chance to escape. Well, he doesn't know I'm after him. So, he, and so let's have a quick look. My dearest Roland, I cannot wait for, your for you to return from Breville. My heart swells with joy. As we will once again soon be together. I yearn for you every night that, that I took, that I looked beside me in my bed and you were not there. How I wish I could have taken you the journey with you. But I understand that these are dangerous times and I would only slow you down. When you return, perhaps we should get away from the chaos of the Imperial City. Let's go back to the cabin in the woods. The one where you said we would always be safe from the world. The one where you took me in your arms and sang songs in, of moonlight and happiness. The one where you said, I love you. Hurry, my love, Rolfina. Okay. So. That seems to cover the basics of that. But I'm not going to the cabin in the woods just yet. I've got other business. We'll let them sort of stew for a bit. There's no real need to... Oh, I'm over-encumbered. That's right. There's no real need to let them get too right? excited. You look the Arboretum. Have you been well recently? Mm. Your skin looks a bit... Mm. Keep away, guys. It seems Somerset Isle has become a much more dangerous place. Seems a lot this, this place has become a much more dangerous place, if you ask me. Are you not feeling well? <sighs> Why does everybody ask me that? Go ahead. Speak. Right. Let's go to... We'll start off by dropping a couple of Welkin stones in the bank. We won't drop them all, as I said. We will um, just drop three. But again, it's a bit of load off, the, uh, off my back. Well. Yes, okay, okay. Then I can probably sell some of this uh, weaponry I've got kicking around. Ah, there's a thought in itself. If he asks me, have I not been feeling well, I'm going to start, you know, stabbing people soon. So we can try and improve these all to get my armor skill improved a bit. <sighs> So that's the King and Queen Tavern and that's Luther's boarding house, but this is the bank. So, sir, you are Mr. Wokenstone, yes? Day. Good day. Um, Woken deposits. You can gain a small amount of bonus to your recharge rate by depositing Wokenstones into your account. Just use the chest over here. Alright, so if I Goodbye. deposit uh, one stone, deposit two stone, deposit three stone, that should leave me with. We're currently holding one stone. Vulcan deposits three. Your recharge bonus of point, point 0.15. Maximum bonus is 3.2. Point, 3 point okay, don't do anything. So, now that is that dealt with, I do have gold on me. Um, I pretty much have the training I want to have, so I'm going to deposit a few thousand back in the bank. I shouldn't need vast amounts more, and as I have discovered, there is a spell to remove it as I need um, that they have given me. 
It will be fine. Um, oh, I was going that way. All right, I'm going to the market district. I'm hopefully selling off some of these goods. Okay, stone wall shields, discount merchandise, Edgar's discount spells. Edgar's discount spells. Now, Edgar, can you please, 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 I have hope I can a help. cheap shock spell? Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to suit you. Link, burning touch, fatal blow. Shocking touch. 12 points for one second. I'm assuming that will do it. This is going to be an expensive test. So, you know. Tell me more. Yeah, Edgar is uh, as good as he can be. Um, I think that's probably as much as I'm going to get out of Edgar. So, it's an expensive test. You've got to be kidding. Uh, it's going to about to, about to get a, become a more expensive test by the looks of it. Um, some of the scamp could also be helpful. But I can't actually do it. So we'll, Thank you we'll for take your that patronage. and we'll give it a go. Because um, I'm genuinely not sure whether it's going to be a Seeing good thing you. or a bad thing for us. It would have actually. Oh God! I bought I that spell. I... No, you don't. Sell, you don't sell. Oh, well, well. You have the scrolls, but you you don't sell them. Uh, Windir staffs. Um, who is going to have the best deal? Probably the best defense again. We'll go in and go to Carafe for a second. We'll speak to Jensine. Oh no, Claudette, sorry. I have sorry. everything for the budding alchemist under one roof. Do you? Um, have a look around. Anything. You oh won't find better Lord. prices in all Tamriel. You have an expert's calcinator and an expert's pestle and mortar. Oh my goodness. Um... And you have blood. Oh, wow. Um, damn. Damn, you have some Please, good stuff. Go on. We need to butter these people up. Bye. I have everything for the budding alchemist under one roof. Um, um, um. Take care. Oh. There's some stuff there I need. Um, right, where am I going to sell, um, Mystic Emporium, Divine Elegance, let's have a look here, um, let's have a look, we need to butter what some of these people for? up a bit more, um, and go into battle with broken equipment. I can't. You will repair it for 52, that's fine. We'll see. Um, you like a joke? I'm going to say you like a joke and coercion. I like you win this one. Yeah, it uh, seems to be that's good with that. Excessive. I won't. That. Yeah, that's there a bit go. excessive. You're, I'm not buying that. It's one. always a bit excessive, well, so. I won't fight you. Don't be silly. I, I can't argue with that. All right. I go. get it. Have a look you, at my I can butter up by looks of it. You are an apprentice, so... Yeah, you I should be able to do fairly decently with. I mean, probably get that. You might need to just... Um, do I want to use I, my magic to... I hope I can help. To bring him up. It's May probably not worth it. Some of my We'll see what we can sell here. We'll see. We've got a Dwarven War Axe here. We don't need that. That's a good deal. We got a Silver Mace. Uh, I wonder if we can bring him up one. 
That's just not. Oh no, he's gonna refuse that. Okay. So that was right on the edge, basically. We'll keep the. Oh, got silver short sword, steel sword. Yeah, we'll keep the silver short sword because you've got a great. That's my basic that weapon. Seems a fair price. Uh, that one's maxed, so you're not going to give me everything I'm after for that. Okay, that gets Thank rid you of for your business. some of the load. Goodbye. At least I won't get um, stuck. I wonder if we can go over to these hot items and find out what's going on there. Um, Gent seems good as new merchandise. I wonder if she takes dodgy goods. Hello, Gent. Feel free to browse, friend. You have been mentioned to several people. Um, can I interest you in some of my wares? Ooh, Akaviri Warblade, you say? Akaviri Warblade. Wow. Two-handed. That would actually be an interesting switch, though, because I am blade. Two-handed. But only 33 uses. Pruh. Is there anything I can sell you? Um, you're not having any of that for that price. Apparently, there is not a lot I can sell you. Which is a little disappointing. Um, I mean, I can probably drive you up there if you if you were a bit more chatty. Yes. Yes. Uh. Um. You like? I'm gonna say you like court. You know, what a great story. And oh god, I've caught that. Yes. Up. Not that's just not funny. Generally Remarkable. no. Um What what that's there just you go. stupid. Well Remarkable. a lot of the things I say are. What don't that's just not funny. What that's just really don't please Well done. Don't, we now we're, now we're getting stupid. somewhere. So, you were saying. Looking to lighten your load, but fill up your coin purse? I mean, have you got any better prices? No Thorneers driving you out of business. Who's, who's Thorneer? So, Tertullian sent you, huh? Um, well, I'm not sure who sent me, but if they have mentioned him. Well, so you may be just what we're looking for. Oh. Uh, spit it out. I'm the chairperson for the Society of Concerned Merchants. We formed this group a while back. To really? Keep a nice, fair economic balance in town. So you mean rigging Not the prices? Not every store is a member, but we're slowly trying to convince them to join. So you have a Everything monopoly. Everything was fine until Thorinir opened his shop nearby. Selling all sorts of merchandise, he undercuts prices like you wouldn't believe. He doesn't always sell what we sell, but it is still a problem. Oh. People who buy tend to want to spend their money there. That leaves none for us. It's getting so bad, a few of us may have to close up shop. He outright refuses to join the society or even discuss the matter. We are convinced he's up to no good. What we need is for you to case his establishment and figure out where he gets his inventory. Find some proof of his wrongdoing, and let us know. We okay. cannot do it ourselves, as he recognizes all of us. The job pays a fair bounty in gold when he is brought to justice. Well, as much as I, I used to be a trader, so I can appreciate where you're coming from with the questionable practices and stuff, but also I'm involved in questionable practices. I'm not sure which way to jump on this. I will look at it. And I will, I will see what I think. Okay, what do you, can you tell me anything about this inventory that makes it questionable? His inventory must be stolen. It has to be. He prices less than it costs to make some of those things. Go see for yourself. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I have an inventory that's quite similar at times. Um. Anything else you can tell me about the guy? 
I hope you're more successful uncovering his scheme than we've been. All right, that's, that's not particularly helpful. Thanks again for your help. Okay. Let's um just nip into the warehouse here. Well met. Well met indeed. Now there's a, I believe. The on you. Look at the Have muscles on me. I've been working out. Have you been well recently? You wear the shadows well, I've been fellow fantastic. Yeah, I should get that bounty paid off as well. I'm walking around with. I need to be a little bit careful, don't I? Um. Oh, you sell some interesting spells. I'm sure there's Voice something of to rapture. Suit you. That's it. Interesting. Uh, you do recharging, you train in speechcraft. Interesting as well. Um, I offer the finest goods and lowest prices. Oh yeah, I remember. You have quite a mad inventory, and you have some serious gold, and you're actually willing to. Pay me some serious gold. Um, can I butter Please, you up further? On. No, but Shadow hide you. for you boosting up the how much you like me could be really worth it. Um, you know what I'm tempted to do? I'm tempted to use one of those scrolls because these are like 30 points for 20 seconds. Um, let's use one of those scrolls and speak you to You wear her. the shadows well, fellow. Yeah, fellow thief, yes. Only quality goods for sale. So, sake. she should be loving me now. Um, I reckon we can get some serious money out of her. Um, I need to find a couple of small items to sell. Uh, potion of endurance, something like that, to... That's more than I test you. out the um, level at which I can sell stuff to her. Bound to be some more. I've got some skooma here. A fine trans. We'll take the skooma. I'll push you up a little more. You need to make a better offer. Okay, fair enough. Um. Oh god, we were at like twenty, weren't we? Uh, twenty-one. Try that, see if it works. You don't expect me to make that deal, do you? Um, uh, apparently not. There you go. Let's try that one. You're trying to drive. Oh me. no, we're dropping like a stone now. You need to make a. Oh, it's all going pear shaped. There we go. Um, potion of might, yep. Yeah. We'll sell the sea stride as That's well. Fed. Can we? Get her happiness up a little more. That's a fair deal. It'd be nice if we could. Just to, um. Just to push her over the edge. I'm gonna sell that Minotaur horn while I see it passing me by. Um. I think I sold the ogre's teeth. Um. I'm gonna sell all of those as well. I need to raise the funds to get those bits off that lady be even better if I could make her ha happier see I, I, yeah she, she's getting it's getting cheaper as she got happier there so I'm gonna give that another try but it's right on the edge yeah she took it she took it so that leaves me with 1610 the apron of Adonis which I'm That's willing to I go with. Pay. I'm not going to sell it for less than that. And this, this I can sell for a whopping 3,000. Wow, she's quite happy now. Um, I wonder if I've got something else that I can sell to her. I don't expect oh. me. You need to no, make a... No, 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 come on. That's more than I'd usually pay. That's it. Take the backpacks, yeah. Okay, we'll keep it at that. But that's still... 2999 for the Curious. Oh. That's some serious money's worth right there. We're going to be making our quids in here. Let's see if there's anything else 
here we can get rid of first that will be worth good money. Um, no, sadly not. Okay, so we're going to keep the Orcish Curious. We're going to sell the rest. I mean, I could sell her my Pestle and Mortar and my Calcinator um, to see if that will push her up. I don't know if it if I end up having to buy one a new one and um, yeah I'm not that's not gonna push her up enough um I sell her my calcinator see if that works no nope. that's that's as much as I'm gonna get so we will sell that and that's big money for me there I've almost got six thousand back so I can get those good items that's stolen, so I can get rid of that. Oh, I think that's pretty much everything I can sell to her right now. Thank you. Come again. Thank you indeed. Who cares Shadow about looking after these these people in the in the town? I mean, I've just managed to get some serious cash out of her. And we can always check on Thor in here and try and find out what, what his deal is, but still. We I might. have everything for the budding alchemist under one roof. Indeed. Well, I have potions and everything you, you need to make You have an expert own. calcinator and an expert pestle and mortar. And that's what I'm interested in. You are going to be a tough bargainer. I would like that, and I would like to see if I can, yeah, you've gone up a little more, so maybe I can get another notch out of you. Yes. And you also have a journeyman's, no, that's journeyman's refiner. What have I got? I've got an apprentice's refiner. So I could sell you that you one drive. and get your journeyman's refiner. Wow, that's that's still expensive as hell. Okay, we'll take it. Drive a hard bargain, lady. Another satisfied customer. Indeed, but it's worth oh, it. Too. It's worth it because we're going to get some serious al alchemical mileage out of that. Right. And do we talk to Thornir? We might give him a bit of a go. She was on about the copious coin purse, I think it was, or something like this. I have met you before, Mr. Thornir. But we will talk to you about your illicit goods and whether you will trade with us in illicit goods. Or maybe we can just bribe him next time. As I will say... Thank you very much for watching, like and subscribe as always, and join us again next time. Thanks a lot.